Hi friends, today we are just going to talk about this important photo or whatever you can say. It's very, very, very important, I would like to say, because it's going to help you understand what's happening in the current world. So I'll just make it bigger so that everyone can see. So everyone before in SAP, everyone used to stay in on-premise. Okay, now with uh, with um, with new cloud solution coming and uh, there is always uh, a process of going to the cloud and all those things. It's just like a cycle. Uh, people are slowly moving to the cloud. So most of the people are generally go to the public cloud solution. Okay. And then there is this private cloud. So just to understand when people say you will hear this all the time. And this is for anyone who is uh, who is a SAP expert or SAP consultant or anyone who is a fresher also. You will see this. You will under try to understand this thing. So on premise it was same thing, full scope, all industry solution. Private cloud is the same. This is standardized process. So standardized process means since it's a public cloud. That means you are renting the space and there are other companies like you're working for Nestle and suppose there is another food company, Kraft Food, is using the public cloud. So then the solution they are doing, the code and all those configuration, more or less, the generic stuff is standardized. So you cannot have specific stuff there. Okay. Then you can do configure, extend and modify. So you there here you can see configuration extend and modify so modify so there you come where you have a bunch of evapors and you have more custom development being done but once once you <clears throat> once you do this in the private cloud you have problem you cannot do that so it becomes more configuration it's like an ariba on concur where you cannot put code okay uh, so that's that's the that's the thing so you get stringent so uh, clients who wants to who wants uh, changes happening right away it may not happen for months or years because there is no solution so you will so here that's the thing when you have on premise and when you have private cloud and public cloud you probably want to get rid of your evapors or some of the some of the people so th those are very important stuff that uh, that you want to you want to see so those things which which will be very essential so the next portion is the customer infrastructure or IAS. So here you will have the customer infrastructure uh, solution uh, where the infrastructure work will be from infrastructure as a service or it can be anything. So this would be and this can be related with, uh, with it can be Oracle, it can be Google or something. But when you have private cloud and public cloud SAP infrastructure and SAP infrastructure. Sometimes I think for public cloud also they allow you to now take other third-party solution like Google, Azure, and you know my my, my it's Google Cloud, Microsoft Azure, and others. Then you have the yearly innovation cycle, which happens yearly. This one also happens yearly. Okay, the private and this happens quarterly, because when you are sharing the 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 instance the process with another customer. Now when you are sharing, trust me. Everything is secure. They will not see your data and all those things. But the whole underlying, the bottom line technology is being shared. That's why you have quarterly, so you can make changes. They SAP can make changes and all those things. And then you have traditional perpetual licensing and subscription or perpetual licensing and this is licensing. So very important thing is in on-premise, configure, extend, and modify. So lots of times you go to cloud and then you're saying, okay, now I need this change. Well, wait. Hold on your house, look for standard stuff because there might not be any standard stuff and you have to live with it. So there can be stuff. So uh, that doesn't mean that like lots of times that's why you might have to build report. They have reporting and all those things. But you, they will not allow you to post stuff that way. So any co companies that are very much changes oriented and all those things and they want things right away and they don't have a real, they have a very complex solution, go for on trends. But anyone who is a simple solution, like mid-sized company, very process oriented, you can go for the cloud solution. So that's it. Uh, this is very important. Try to understand. And that's it for today. Uh, thanks for listening to me and stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP.